Yeah. What's going on, y'all? It's your boy iPod King Carter here. I'm back with some Need for Speed. I'm currently on my way to the garage. Amy hit my jack. You already know what time it is, bro. I think she about to give me the yams. Listen, she got the jumper on. I don't think she got no drawers on under it, so it might go down in the garage. All this oil and all this fine me and her. I'm just saying, what do you guys think? Leave your comment in the comment section. Is she going to give up the yams? I can hear you creeping out there. Yeah, touch my playlist and die. Oh, hey. Travis mentioned you worked a couple cars yourself, so that's cool. Uh, okay. One house rule. Use whatever tool you want, honestly. Just put them back where you found them. Other than that, knock yourself out. Uh, oh, this is my latest obsession. Here. Listen to that cloud, man. This is going to be my master build. I can feel it. I want it ready for Nakai-san to see before he leaves the city. <sighs> Props from an artist like him could really put this shop on the map, you know? Okay, well, I'm, I'm done. I'm gonna head out, maybe catch Spike. Uh, oh, Travis shifted those rides so there's space for you now. And you should take it before he replaces that junk with more junk. It's a, it's a good time to uh, get your head straight, you know? Plan your build. Channel your vision. Whoa, I'm starting to sound like Travis. Okay, I'm gone, I'm out. Um, have fun. And maybe I'll see you out there, yeah? Oh, and um, put the tools back. Later, man. Rejected, ladies and gentlemen. Yo, I could have swore she was about to give it up. Listen, did y'all see when she did the little finger like come in? Oh my god, I thought it was about to go down in the garage, but. Your boy got shot down. Nothing happened. So uh, right now, I'm showing you guys all the cars on the cars list. Um, I'm currently thinking about getting two cars on this list. I will point them out to you as they come about. Now, what you guys can see is the current car that I have is the Subaru right here. 27K for that thing. Now, one definite car that I was really, really thinking about, and this is one of my favorite cars, is the Mitsubishi Lancer, bro. Right now, I do own a Mitsubishi uh, SUV, like in real life, so I am a fan of Mitsubishi. Um, the Lancer is definitely like one of those cars on my list that you got to just have, man. And if you don't have it, it's a problem. Also, the Skyline. Yo, the Sky... Listen, you know what it is? Every dope Fast and Furious car that I've ever seen, I want. Period. Point. Blank. I'm just going to go ahead and get that out the way. Um, the Nissan GTR, that joint crazy as well. Um, me, I, I really haven't tested it all, haven't seen what it can do, but you know, some people say that that joint is crazy. Um, the Lamborghinis, I like the Aventador, like the Aventador is crazy. Um, I, I will say it's like probably the best car for me because I had it in Rivals and I loved it. I maxed it out and I did what I had to do with it, but it is what it is um leave what cars you guys like in the comment section and as well you know if anybody has like any dope customizing stories or advice or anything like that leave that in the comment section as well because i'll actually be looking down there seeing what you guys have how much money you put into it what rep level you are you know just tell me anything but right now i'm about to put the only customized thing on my car and that's the wrap i wanted to wrap it in black I got tired of the white, it get dirty too fast. If I chip the paint just a little bit, it'll get on my nerves. Moving on, this is a race versus Spike. This is a nice little circuit race, just me and him. Now, just to let you guys know, I came in the clutch, lap two, final like two miles. I just was like, yo, you know what? I'm about to turn it up. I realized my man was disappearing. I had to hit the Nas, and when I realized I ran out, I said, you know what? Let me follow this 
little blue road. I can't call it call it the yellow brick road because goddamn it, it ain't yellow and it ain't bricks out here. But I go ahead and get that little slipstream speed matching and I pass them. And now we're going into a nice little turn before a mile is left. And I realize, you know what? I gotta drive perfectly or he's gonna keep taking the goddamn first spot. Now, I love little matches like this, not against the computer, more so against regular people because we really be like smashing each other's cars, trying to make each other crash, but the computer really doesn't do that, and it's okay, you know, I, I, I like racing the computer, I like getting my little slip streams and stuff like that, trying to get my speed matching and all that going on, but yo, when you're racing somebody online head up, there's savagery everywhere. Nobody's actually trying to win the match. You're only trying to destroy the other person's car, yo. It's hilarious, man. I'm telling y'all. If you got this game, leave your PSN in the comment section. I'm going to add you up. Get a couple games in, man. We can be savages together. We can go ahead and just mess up everybody in their races that they got going on. If they're trying to zoom by us, we're going to go ahead and make magic happen. But I'll go ahead and win this Horses for Courses. And in this next joint, I got another call from Amy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So now that I'm about to do this drift contest, Amy's all up on me. She wants to know, hey, I want to know if you can drift. I want to know what type of guy you are. I want to know if you're the type of guy for me. Okay, I'm lying. I, I will admit, I am lying. But check it out. This is the great thing that I want to show you guys in this video. This is like a drift 101 type video. If you want to drift, just press on the square button and turn your analog right or left. You can drift as much as you want and usually in these drift contests, you do not have to keep up with everybody else. You can just drift, you can do whatever you want, you can go somewhere else off the map as long as you're getting drift points. Now what I did notice is the person that's in first place is literally destroying everybody like they're drifting is on fleek. But what I noticed was if I pick up a little bit of speed and get to about like 70 miles per hour and then drift, I can get up to almost a thousand points per drift. Now, some of these straightaways weren't that long and I had to take, take basically use my advantage of just swaying back and forth to like get that drift point. And then when I came around the deep corners, I would drift really, really hard. Now, check this out. When you're drifting, right? You want to really take the outside, never take the inside. You only want to take the inside if it's other cars and it's like an actually an actual race where you have to finish. So basically in this little drift contest, since I don't have to finish anything, I just take the outside and just keep drifting, keep stopping, and keep swaying back and forth. Now, I know that my car is basically stock. It's not really too much difference with the car from when I got it besides the wrap and like maybe a few like uh, shocks and exhaust and of course the NOS. But once I do get a car that I'm actually going to put my money into, the hard-earned money from this mode, then I will probably like max that car out in everything. And basically, you have to get certain things in levels. And right now, I think my level is probably about like a four or five. And I need to get to about a six to like upgrade my engine and everything. But the first car I'm going to go after, and you can have up to, I think, like four or five cars, maybe six. I'm going to go after the Mitsubishi Lancer. And of course, you guys already know how I get down. It's going to be on full drift. Everything's going to be on drift crazy. Your boy's going to be the drift king, not drift kid. This is not Fast and Furious. This is Need for Speed. So I'm going to be doing what I need to do. Now, uh, I want to thank you guys for watching this video. I came in first by doing my own thing. I ain't stick with the clan. I didn't stick with the crew. I did me, and I won. But um, Amy hit me up again. You know what I'm saying? Telling me, hey, Big Daddy, you the best ever. Oh, my God. Can you have my babies? I'm just saying, get up in this jumper. Yerp. Thank you for watching and be sure to like this video. For more videos from this particular mode, click more videos. If you want to see more content from IKC, click subscribe.